back to our channel. Today I am going to show you an experiment. For that you will need a styrofoam cup or a bowl and some nail polish. Take a few drops of nail polish into the cup and wait for a few seconds. You can observe the formation of bubbles here. So then slowly lift the bowl and you can see that a hole is formed. As you can see there is a hole in the styrofoam and the reason behind this is styrofoam is made up of foamed up polymer which has a lot of air crap inside it. That's why these cups and uh, bowls are very lightweight. Nail polish contains a chemical called acetone. Acetone is a great solvent for this particular plastic. So when the cup is placed in acetone or when you put a few drops of acetone in the cup, the small amount of plastic present in the cup dissolves and the cup rapidly disintegrates. So the big question in everyone's mind is obviously, what does this mean for our nails? Can it really be okay to put this stuff on there even in limited quantities? Fortunately, nails are not made of plastic, so acetone continues to be safe for use as a nail polish. So we can use nail polish without any hesitation because our nails are not made up of the plastic used in styrofoam. Acetone is used in a large scale to disintegrate styrofoam things because it disintegrates very fast. Second experiment which we are going to do with nail polish is you have first take a bowl of water, take some nail polish in it, then take a match and light it. You can see that it caught fire. This occurs because of the acetone in this nail polish. Acetone is a flammable substance, so this fire occurs. That's why it is not advisable to use nail polish near fire. You can see that the nail polish is burning. The black thing around the fire is the nail polish which is burnt. The acetone is all used up so now it will stop burning. If you like these experiments, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more interesting experiments. And don't forget to comment down below. Thanks for watching.